Okay, um, this little screencast is to uh, demonstrate a um, idiosyncrasy in the way that the Mercalli V2 plug-in works with uh, Sony Vegas Pro. In this case, it's the Sony Vegas Pro 11, 64-bit. So, uh, what we're going to want to do is we have a blank project here, and we want to set our project properties. And we do this uh, during using the recommended procedure, uh, which is to um, go to properties and use the match media settings uh, wizard to navigate to the uh, uh, source footage that we want to use. In this case, we are using a, um, a clip which is. Um, 1920 by 1080 60i. This happens to be the clip right here. I'm going to right click on that and go to media info here uh, just so indeed we can see that this is uh, 1920 by 1080 29.97 frames per second and it is interlaced um, uh, top field first. Okay so we're going to click on that click open and that sets our um, project properties to match that source clip. Incidentally, notice, <clears throat> uh, this is going to come, become critical later, that uh, the deinterlace method is uh, set to none uh, because in this particular case we uh, are not going to do any deinterlacing in this project. We're starting with interlaced. We have interlaced on the timeline and we're going to render to uh, interlaced. So we're going to apply that. Click OK. And then we're going to go back to the same clip um, and uh, drop that clip uh, on the timeline. And um, just um, for demonstration purposes we're going to play that. And as you can see that's um, really uh, pretty shaky. Okay. So the next thing that we want to do is to um, apply the Mercalli um, D-Shaker stabilization effect and uh, we're going to use the um, Rocksteady, I get usually default to 98%, Rocksteady camera with rolling shutter compensation uh, on this, uh, avoid border and uh, start the analysis. So it goes through this. We'll be back in just a second or two. Okay, uh, we're now done with our stabilization and um, we're going to see how this looks. Make this just a little bit bigger here and play it. And as you can see, this is a uh, fairly well stabilized but very wobbly uh, video, which looks like uh, the uh, rolling shutter um, uh, portion of the sta stabilization didn't work very well. May or may not be. So we're going to stop that, put this back here. Um, now here's the way that I found to circumvent that problem. Uh, and 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 uh, this is not the normal way that you would use Sony Vegas, uh, but if we go to properties and set a deinterlaced method here to our project, click apply, click OK, and go back to our um, uh, video uh, effect and uh, redo the um, Mercalli analysis. Again, it's going to take a few seconds, so uh, we'll go away and come back. Okay, we're done here. And um, now if we uh, reduce this back down, and now if we look at our um, uh, playback, we can see that uh, we indeed do have rock steady stabilization.